his Khalwa Kuntla Khavita has been uh, placed under custody and uh, she has been sought for remand and probably further questioning tomorrow or to be produced before the Rouse Avenue court. Uh, after the due process was followed and a, del and a detailed search and seizure under Section 17 of the PMLA Act has been followed. And it was decided that remanding and taking her into custody, owing to the fact that sir, certain incriminating evidence, etc., was found, was decided under Section 19 of the Prevention of Honey Laundering Act. Calling this politically motivated that uh, tomorrow is going to be the notification day when the BJP is deliberately doing this is absolute rubbish and ridiculous because the opposition parties will always say that the same is politically motivated when the said case has been investigated for the last two years and many people are in jail. Uh, they are not able to get bail, including Mr. Mani Hisodia and Mr. Uh, uh, and others. Several of them have turned approvers, including Sharachandra Reddy and Arun Pillai, who specifically stated that he was Ms. K. Kavita's representative in the entire transaction. Hence, the ED following the due process of the law has absolutely nothing to do with the political ramifications or whatever the state of uh, the nation is at the moment and to call it politically motivated is absolute rubbish because if that were the case, then it would have been done way back prior to October it, uh, itself. To besmirch and malign the enforcement agencies has become the, the chosen thing to, stay, uh, uh, thing to say of the opposition and this is absolutely ridiculous and rubbish because this is nothing but insulting the due process of law, the judiciary and the rule of law in this country. And that is and that cannot be allowed in a constitutional democracy such as India, when the due process of law and the procedure established under under the law, especially the Prevention of Money Laundering Act is being followed in letter and in spirit.